Quincy Notre Dame High School is using cutting-edge technology to keep their future students and teachers engaged. And what we are going to do is that we're rolling out a one-to-one -one, uh, technology learning package in which all incoming freshmen for the 2012-2013 school year will receive an iPad at the beginning of the school year. I am very excited about the iPad program because it's, we have to move into the future and we have to teach the kids how to handle all this equipment and all this technology for their everyday lives. The technology plan provides iPads for incoming freshmen every single year for and after the 2012-2013 school year. And an anonymous donor started it all. The startup was, was a, a, a substantial gift that was given by uh, an anonymous donor and uh, that person wants to remain that way, basically saying, here is uh, a, a goodly sum of money. Uh, what I want is Quincy Notre Dame to be at the forefront of technology and education. The iPads will allow a blended curriculum for students, incorporating both textbooks and iPads in the classroom, hoping to enhance learning for students and teachers. And so I can move around the room and watch what kids are doing. I don't have to be the person that's standing in the front of the room talking to them. I can go around and monitor students individually a lot better. I think uh, it's a great opportunity for the incoming freshmen to uh, get prepared for the real world. Um, it's so technological out there these days that um, I think it's essential to be able to use technology. Only incoming freshmen will be given personal iPads, but an iPad cart will be available for other students. Still, there is some jealousy among upperclassmen. I'm a little jealous that I'm not getting an iPad, but at the same time, you know, every, you know, my time has ended here, you know, or will be, and their time is beginning, and um, it's a great opportunity for them. Quincy Notre Dame is requiring teachers to undergo iPad workshops in preparation to permanently integrate the technology into the classrooms next year. Kristen Aguirre, KHQA News, Quincy.